What is going on Artifact people? My name is Alpha and welcome to Artifact. I've been waiting for this game for so long uh, but now we finally are here and with our first video I figured we would do some pack opening so I have 60 unopened packs. Uh, I bought 25 times 2 so I bought 50 and then I have my original 10 packs. So we're going to open these packs and we're going to see how this goes. So uh, each pack you end up getting 12 cards. You get three uncommons. You get, I think it's, was it three uncommons, eight commons, and one rare? They also have a special chance, 5% chance of a common becoming an uncommon and a uh, uncommon becoming a rare. So, uh, things I'm looking for out of this probably the elusive drow and axe. Those are the biggest ones. Uh, some blink daggers, maybe some other things to build some decks that I'm thinking about. But let's get right into it and let's just start. So, for this, usually the hero is right here. Usually if it's a common hero, it's here. If it's an uncommon hero, it's here. I've seen a bunch of pack openings already. This one is always our rare, so we don't so we don't ever have to worry about that. But it looks like we have some uncommon or some common items as the gold borders are item cards. So uh, with that, I turned off the voices, so there will be not be any text speech because I just don't want to be overrun while doing this video. So, um, so yeah, let's see how we go and let's see how our 60 packs go. You have to be really careful when you oh my God, did I? Put this thing on. Did I seriously? I seriously thought I turned that down. No. Did it, does it not? Whatever. All right, whatever. I thought I skipped it, but whatever. So we got an Assassin's Apprentice, a Payday, an Iron Fog Goldmine. Like this is a really good black pack. Like Assassin's Apprentice, Paydays, and Iron Fog Goldmines. Those are really good cards to get, um, especially for draft. Uh, we end up getting a Collateral Damage. This is a really big black pack. So it's a possible hero, uncommon hero. No. So we're gonna have a rare hero right off the first, right on the first pack. Oh, King Fork Turk is nice. This one, Thunderstorm, is a nice card, and we have a Stonehall Elite. Oh, that's a great card. This is a great card for red decks. So our first rare, which is a hero, is going to be Center of War Runner. Okay, all right, I like him. I like him. He's pretty decent. He's like a, he's kind of like a Legion Commander, but just not as good. Uh, so yeah, let's keep going. So it's gonna take us a while to get through this, so I'm not gonna stop every time. Uh, like to shake things up and see what I'm probably gonna turn the sound down so you guys can't hear hardly any of this. I don't know why the stupid text to speech is on. Why the speech is on? I could have sworn I I got rid of that because I have the unit speech and the voice speech down. So I don't. I'm just gonna turn. No, no, play sounds. That probably just that will probably turn the whole sound off. I'm just gonna turn the imp sounds down just in case that's it too. Um. Anyways, I still haven't got a hero yet. Ah, Timbersaw. Timbersaw's our hero. So, a couple more paydays. This is going to be good for a payday deck. Trebuchets. Uh, this is good. Clash of Mean Hourglass is great. Uh, Assassin's Veil is another good card. And our rare is going to be Heroic Resolve. Uh, it's not that great. It's, it's, eh, it's shmi. So, uh, so. Another. And we haven't had an upgrade yet. are led by Lady Anshu. And their mere presence can I wish I could turn this off. I, I don't even know how to turn that off. Anyways, we're just going to listen. Thunder High Pack. That's a great card to get. Hellbear Crippler is pretty good. Fight Through the Pain is alright. Armor Rebellion's decent. Another Timber Saw. And our rare is Curse of Atrophy. Yeah. I'm going to kind of go blow through them really like, quickly. I'm not going to stop, but I've been waiting for this for so long. So, And I haven't got an upgrade yet. Leather so. armor is cheaper. But I'm getting a lot of common armors, so I'm getting a lot of uncommon heroes. Uh, Oak Lodi Vandals, uh, better late than ever, pretty decent. We get some in, out of our packs. I'm sorry, out of our starter decks. So, uh, Prelix, nice. I actually wanted a Prelix. I want I want a creep deck uh, using that gank. Great black card. Remus Pillager, another good one. Path of the Cunning. Oh, God, that's a terrible card. Ugh. So. Uh, should be a hero. Bristleback. Very nice. I will always take a Bristleback when I can. Vogel, Seder Duelist from S Blessing. That's always nice. Six damage to towers, pretty decent. 
Uh, Kingfoot Plate, Temple of War, Murder Plot, and a Raise. Eh, raise, I think Raise is one of those things that's like, it, it's like a one of. I, I would probably do it as a one of. I don't know how long this is going to take for me to do 60, but I'm going to probably start the doing them very quickly. And a hip fire, that's good. Great card. Another uh, this. Luna. Oh, this is definitely A tier blue card right here. That's great. And. Routed. Okay. For the memes. You gotta get it for the memes. It's not easy, baby. Ogre. That's a great blue. Like, we're getting a lot of decent blues. Arcane Assault. Sensor, Crippling, Decoy. You know uh, Fights of the Pain. Ragnell Signet Ring is a very good card for draft. Compel. Uh, I just like because you get to choose a unit, choose a combat target for it, and then get a card out of it. So you, you literally, you literally one for one it. You know, so you use one card to get another card, but you get a, you get to choose a combat target. Divine Purpose, nice. This is full of modify. So if you guys are unsure about um, any of the wordings or any of that, please go to the website. Finally, we get an upgrade. So that. This became a rare. So that uncommon became a rare. My father was Lycan? We already have a Lycan, so I guess we'll, we'll do that off. Evil must have very good. Fairness, more vocal martyrs. Selfish cleric. My mother was Escape room. Huh? Okay. Alright, I'm not, I'm not mad about that. A woman beloved by her people as and a grand melee. Eh. So it's not too bad. We did get a rare hero out of the first time, so I wasn't expecting to get too horribly much out of this. It's not easy Another Ogre Magi, Rebel Decoys, Better Late Than Evers. I think now we have like five of those. Remasks, Stonehall Cloak is good. Defend the Weak is pretty, pretty okay. Sister of the Veil is a great card. Another hero. Hmm. So they're going pretty decent. Ooh, that got up. Uh, so we don't have a hero yet. A lot of black. That's a very heavy black pack. Another timber saw. Ah, I was hoping for a rare hero. We have tall investments. Eh. The Agony of Sentub is good in the Sister of the Veil. More slays and Oglody Vandals and Iron Fogs are good. Especially if you want to do uh, like a black, uh, like black payday build. It's not easy being the smartest in the world. Uh, Smeevils. The, all the Smeevils are pretty interesting. They're all interesting cards. Uh, buying time, lock. Uh, cool thing about lock is that lock actually locks opponents from using. God, I hate. I hate that this thing talks over me. Yes, yes, we do. That is just, that is gonna. That is just gonna bump the shit out of me. Nope, I'm not gonna do that. Skip startup movies. There. Uh, since I was there. Still strength, pretty good. Lost some time, another for a lock deck if you want to build some lock. Ooh, we got a rare item. Please horn of the alpha. Please horn of the alpha. Or if I start the tyrant, I'll take that. Alright. <laughs> ah, it's, it's a... She was going to be good if it wasn't so overly priced. I love the pack openings in this, this is really good. Nothing Our upgraded. Is not a clever name. But it's cold there. looks like we're gonna Very get cold. And those that don't Hold on a second. Weather? Sorry about that. We had a I had a phone call. My bad. So uh looking what the hell did I get? Oh, possibility of a rare hero. Another Pelix. Alright. Uh, let's see what we got. Ravenhook. I think this card could be good. But I just don't think it's not right now with this initial set release. Like, I think the cost of setting it down is just too high. It's not easy oh, God, another ogre. Hit fire and ogle vandy. Complete as vigil. Looking for those blink daggers, too. Blink daggers are definitely going to be worth something. And literally the worst card in the entire game as a rare. Shut up, ogre. Nobody cares about you. I'm no Ooh, Magnus. Very nice. West. Magnus has got a great... His uh, his signature card is great. Modify unit with plus three attack, plus three cleave. And it's... Oh, my bad. I didn't mean to... I guess we'll just open it like this from now on. I'll just start going through it and looking. 
Uh, Tyler State, that's what really bad. Stonehall Cloaks and Plates are good. Rebel Instigator and a second Stonehall Elite. Always looking for that. Ogre Constructs, very nice. Time of Triumph, yes! Mm, red decks, let's go. I need two more of these and a red deck can happen. I also need an Axe and a Legionnaire <laughs> and, a, and an LC, but uh, I could probably do it with something else. But the Time of Triumph, that's a great card. It's, that is a game winner right there. It's definitely a game winning card. Lord is willing to pay Ooh, Bounty Hunter. There you go. Now we can get it done. Oh, Mr. Ververnus. By far the best, the best improvement in the entire game. Modify plus one attack before the action phase. That's just, that just that makes it so good. Oh, Champion of the Ancient. Not bad. I'm probably just going to turn the sound really far down. A Necrophos. We already have one. They came out of our starter decks. Uh, smash the Defense is not bad. That's basically just to condemn an improvement and get a card draw. So you're, one of, you're basically plus one because you're minus one out of your hand, but you're minus one your opponent, so it evens out to a, to a to zero, and then you draw cards, so it's a plus one. So anytime you play this, it's a plus one. And that's Champion of the Ancient. Eh. So I don't know how many packs I have left. Skyrath Mage. I think it's we already have him. I think he comes in the starter deck. So, uh, Smeeple and Sivra. More of these. Four sights. Good. Card draw deck. And Rambinging so Hellbear. So we have 44 packs left. And wait. Let's skip through them. Oh. What? That was weird. Okay. Ugh. I don't know what the hell happened there. Like, it bugged out, and it, like, didn't open a pack, so... There we go. Ugh, get back into the pack opening. It, like, bugged out on me. I care little for the Zeus! Yes! Great card. I have no time. In the war between the red mist uh, Capel, and the another good one. And the plight of the oh, one of the worst items in the game. Shut up, Zeus. Nobody cares about you. Ooh, got an uncommon hero, please. Legion Commander? As a child. Abaddon. Okay. Abaddon. Or Abaddon, as people call him. Uh, I call him Abaddon. I've always known him as Abaddon. A third stone all elite. That's very good. One true Susser. That's good for extra card draw on a blue deck. And that is the worst item in the entire game. Just plus four, negative two, so you literally just... Yeah, whatever. It's really bad. <laughs> it's really bad. For the warrior on a budget. Oh, Disciple and Evermore. That's a win condition right there. Another Abaddon. A Path of the Bull. So we're about 20 packs in. We've gotten one rare out of 20 packs. One rare hero out of 20 packs. Ooh. I know that's Venge's voice actress. Bronze Legionnaire. Wow, that, is that my first Bronze Legionnaire? I think it is. Wow. That's that's very unimpressive. Uh, Apotheosis Blade. I could be happy about that. This is a game winner right here. You put this thing on, and it is, it is, it is pretty much, yeah. It condemns enemy heroes that deal damage, battle damage to that it deals damage. Basically, if this thing attacks something, it's dying, guaranteed. If it's a hero, it's dead. Anyways, that's that's that was a decent rare. That was a, that was a very good rare to get. Time of Triumph is still probably the best one we've gotten so far. Really careful Please, put this thing Legion on. Commander. Okay, when it comes to red heroes, there are two there are two of the best red heroes in the game. One is Axe, which is a rare, and then there is this one, which is kind of Axe's second in command, which is Legion. Legion. Actually, I think in the lore-wise, Legion is on the opposite side of this war, as the Red Mist, who is being led by Sorlacon, is where Axe is actually from, because Axe, in his lore, has actually killed his entire Red Mist horde because he wanted to be the strongest. So when, every, when he killed everybody else, he was now considered himself to be the strongest. So, But she's basically on the other side, and her lore is pretty decent, too, uh, especially when it comes to her Arcana and Dota, too. But Soul Spring, that's actually really good. That's good for a green deck. Like a green regeneration deck. Uh, another ugly vandal, more slays. Those are all really good. Man, I've waited. I've waited for this for so long. 
So I'm like, I'm like excited to hopefully get something good. Very cold. Another Prelix. Faster. By far the second or even the first best item in the game. The best armor item in the game right here. It, uh, it gives you plus three armor. It gives you rapid deployment and it gives your tower plus three armor. Like, so you come back and you can defend a tower with just literally one hero. So creeps can't touch a tower. It, it's, it's so good. Oh. Timber saw. Oh, blink dagger. First blink dagger right there. These things are like three bucks a pop now. At least at the time of when this gets set out. Incarnation of Selimene. This is for the blue combo deck. If you have a blue combo deck, this one is the one you need. You need this one, you need Prolix. Uh, no, no, you need Kana. I think you need Prolix, Kana, and like a couple other cards. And you need like two or three of these uh, incarnations. That's a really good pickup though. Feel betrayed that I left the red mist. Tide Hunter? It's not bad, but it's not great. Um, pretty decent. Getting a lot of decent red heroes. There we go. Horn of the Alpha. Uh, that's so good. Especially, like, we got some really good black heroes. Like, we don't have a PA. We need a PA. I need a P. Oh, not again. It keeps bugging out where it says we can't find anything, and if you click on the pack, it just sits there. So, keep going. Keep trying. So, uh, yeah, pretty decent. Another good Luna. Assured Destruction. Eh. Maybe if we get a couple more times of Triumph, that would be really good if we can get another time of Triumph. Even two of them would be amazing right now. Another Prelix. Emissary. Great. That's a great card right there. Emissary is a really cool effect for every turn. You can add plus two attack and plus two health to a unit. Mist of Avernus. Yeah, second Mist of Avernus. PA, finally. Good black hero. We finally, I think we have like the two best black heroes in uh, Bounty Hunter and PA. Another Bronze Legionnaire. Uh, yeah, Legion Standard Bear and a Satyr Magician. This is basically kind of like a five level creep that restores your tower mana. Curse of Atrophy. Yeah. And Cypher of Evermore is always a good card to get as a Cypher. I think we finally have three. Ursa. I think we already have one. I think it comes in the starter deck. Grand Malay. Divine Intervention. Not bad. That's a decent card. Another Oak Conscript. Uh, Vogel Martyrs and Arm. I knew it was going to get a lot of Vogel Martyrs and all of that. Oh my god, I hate my life. Hate it. Hate it. Ugh. Like weird, it keeps going offline and online. Nope, I already have it. Ooh, what? Blink Dagger in three rares? What? Rare item? Suck the shield? Are too high. Cover of nine? So Not I bad. My time. And literally the worst card in the entire game. Wow, three rares and all of them were borderline mediocre. Sense. Sven, we already have, comes in the, uh, comes in the pack, uh, the, the starter deck. Alright, this one's not bad. Caught unprepared could be used. Uh, so. Ursa, Iron Fog, Lodestone. Uh, spot weakness for card draw and red, which is good because red doesn't have any of that stuff. Thunder Hide Alpha. Okay. okay. I can take a Thunder Hide Alpha. I'm hoping for another, at least one or two more rare heroes, and I haven't gotten any yet. Viper. Another emissary, very nice. It looks like we're gonna have a really good green black type deck. Like we do like a green black creep, like gold generation deck, because we have the two best black heroes. Venomancer, first Venomancer, I'll take that. Uh, face boost is good. We have two bling daggers, which is very good, and a second time a triumph. We have the second best red hero in the game. If we can get an axe, like we'd have all the set for a red green deck. Home field advantage. Good in draft. Viper. Emissary. Third emissary. And a third. Oh my god, this pack is amazing. We got a third time of triumph and a third emissary of corn. Oh, that's amazing. That pack was great. Like, that. Oh, that was such a good pack. Another Venomancer. 
eight uh, work. Not too horribly a OP on this one. And an escape. Route. 24 packs left. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. The vigil were renowned for their skills in a sniper. The Very nice. Sven, That's Peter a really great. And Clemens have captured the imagination of so At any cost. That's a really good blue card. I would, I would need a couple more of those, but those are, that's a really good blue one. Like we have Prolix. We just need, we need Kana. We need Kana for the creep deck. Anything is killable. The only question is if you can live long enough to spark. Another Timber Saw. How about the Dominator? That's not bad. So we got a Helm of the Dominator. That's really... Another Ursa. Assassin's Veil, Rose Leaf Rejuvenator. That's a pretty decent one. Paydays. And the worst card in the game. I'm kind of going through these quickly. Like, because... I, I know what a lot of these Here cards do already. Beastmaster. First Beastmaster. Very nice. Uh, more Slays, Bellows. To them... This Home build advantage. Is a rite of passage. Yeah. But I the Beastmaster was nice. That's like a. It's probably maybe a maybe an A tier. Vanessa wanted to take it to the burnt hall. Pierpont wanted it safely locked away. Sorlacon, very play. nice. That's it for uh, if you're gonna build like a an attack. What is it? Uh, Reluctantly, I, they agreed. She's really good at uh, like attacking towers. Uh, she gets plus four damage whenever she hits a tower, and plus. Assault Ladders makes it so anything that hits it does two extra damage, so creeps do four damage, so it adds up real quick. Mercenary Exiles? Okay, not bad. Less than 20 packs left. So, 60 packs. Still can't believe it. You have to be really careful when you... It's another Sora Lakarn. Another Rising Anger. Clear the deck. Good for red. Let's see. Ooh. I think we got a rare hero, boys. I think we got a rare hero. We got two, two rares. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Ooh. Okay, we got a rare hero. Rare hero. One of some that we could get. Omni Knight. Very nice. I saw, I saw the green and I was excited. I thought it was a drow, but Omni Knight is. I will definitely take an Omni Knight. Very well, a tier, uh, a tier green card. So. Another Lycan, another Divine another Intervention, Stars Aligned. Is that my first Stars Aligned? Have I seriously opened like 30 packs and not gotten a Stars Aligned? Wow, and the most RNG infuriating card in the entire game. Cheating Death. Oh, that card is so RNG. <laughs> like, it's either going to go really well for you or really horrible. Another Lycan, another Rose Leaf. Steel Strength. Still good. I think that's my third one. A random Golden Ticket, which gives you a random item. Pit Fighter of Koich. 15 packs left. Hopefully one more rare hero. We've only gotten two. I figured it would be. So, Slay. Soul of Spring. Very nice. That's the second one. We might be able to make like a regen deck with like Omni Knight and Enchantress. I don't know if I got an Enchantress though. I don't think I got one. I don't think I got an enchantress. The veiled sisterhood gave me Another. everything. Phantom. My life, my skills, my family. Uh, cleansing right. Not bad. So uh, when the shield is okay in draft. List of names. The oath. I never one of what it is an improvement. I need to do. A really good improvement. Uh, you can't play any spells or creeps whenever this is active in a lane, but but everything in the lane now has plus four attack, so uh, you could easily drop. Like, uh, what is it? Disciple and Evermore, and then drop this, and everything gets plus six attack. And you can push a tower for damage. For years, I Necrophos already comes in the, the uh, the, the, what is it? Is? By city. Uh, what is but it? Now, in the starter deck. Enough magic, good card. Has arisen. Escape route? If I think that's our third escape route. Lord, Another bounty hunter. Clive Ramin Hourglass, very good. Call the reserves, not bad. Where you get, but you can summon him in any lane, which is not bad. Another routed. For the means. Another Necrophos. Tyler State Sensor, really good in draft. Another Conscript. Assassin's. 
Pit Fighter Aquage, this is the second one. A Winter Wyvern. That's actually the first Winter Wyvern. I have two. Two. Hopefully this can turn into a hero. Nope, Assure Destruction. And another Nictitious. I have like four of those Nictitious guards now. So our rares are getting kind of My homeland kind of iffy. Bloodseeker, first new card. New hero card. Crystal streams and bountiful harvest. It is He's okay. Like, gift if his gods, signature card wasn't so bad, gift he could be. He could have been like really right good because his ability is really good, which is like he fully heals whenever a unit blocking it dies. Wins. So like, if you can give him a bunch of damage, he can and he can survive the hit, he'll heal himself, which is really nice. Rick, Tresden, There's our enchantress. Sorla Khan. You ask any one of them, and they will spin your As it story is, regen deck is a possibility now. And every divine single purpose. One of them is I think it's their second divine purpose too. We might be able to throw those splashes in. I know these people think. No, the legion commander. Those. That's always them. nice. No I might actually out. sell that. At any cost, second at any cost. I know we're less than ten. I think we're at like five or six packs left. I care little for the more Zeus. I have no stake in the wall. I have five packs the left. The Steam Cannon, very good, very good card. Another and Thunder Hype pack. So let's do it. We got five packs left. Can we get another rare hero? The Forgers of Stonehall Black. Another Bristol bag. Day and night, fueling Emperor Galanius's Another Conflagration. Very nice blue card. Very good. Very sought after. Final four packs. What do we got? I've given myself another Sven. I will train with them. Learn their ways. Another routed. That's our third routed. And another rampage and hell bear. You have to be really careful when you help another put Luna. This thing on. And uh, God, that McDishes, why? Ugh. Another timber saw. Remote detonation, not bad, not bad. Solo spring, that's our third solo spring. We're definitely gonna do the regen deck. We're gonna make the regen deck. It's gonna happen. Another Magnus. Grand Melee. All right, guys, that was it. Sixty packs, sixty of them. All right, you guys. So we successfully did 300 plus cards we got 18 event tickets and we're 9 of 20 for the getting the next one so we have a bunch of event tickets for stuff so i'm gonna now look and see what i need <clears throat> i'm gonna see what i need um so i didn't get a magazine i didn't get a pug i didn't get a crystal main i didn't get like half of these wow i got like i got so many of like the normal heroes anyways i'm gonna see if i could snag me i'm not getting the axe the axe is stupid but uh, I don't have enough to snag a Kana right now. I might be able to snag like a Lich or Tinker. Actually, if I just wait, I can snag whatever I'm missing. But cool thing though, hold on, cool thing, uh, is that with mine, I ended up getting three Time of Triumphs, which was really good for the red deck. So, um, so if I can get a Drow Ranger, and an axe, I might be able to build like one of the best decks out there, which is a green red deck. Um, looking at it, I need I do need one Mist of Avernus, so I am gonna actually pick that up. I'm gonna purchase that one Mist of Avernus because I, I want to have the three. Uh, cheating death, I'm kind of eh, I don't really need. I didn't get any Spring the Traps, which don't seem like they're all that big. Incarnation of Salamanes, I might actually pick that up for the blue for the blue deck. There's a blue combo deck that runs that, but it really requires a bunch of other things. Um, we didn't get one Wingfall Hammer, and we didn't get any Cloaks of Endless Carnage, no Poaching Knives, no Bracers of Sacrifice, and no Jasper Daggers. Like, But we also are only one Blink Dagger off, so I think I'll pick that up too. I'll pick up the one Blink Dagger. So for a buck 86, I'm going to pick this up, so... Uh, I need to make sure that you guys can't see that. Nope, you guys can. Anyways. 
anyways i'm gonna pick those up later but i hope you guys enjoy this uh we got quite a bit of cool yeah, we got some pretty cool stuff yes i'm just gonna discard them so that's pretty cool uh let's see here collection so going by what we own we actually got some really cool stuff so so we could start building a deck uh, i really think the legion commander was a steal getting that um the centaur is not bad so i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh i don't know why i keep doing this yeah. okay i'm gonna be done but uh let's look what other was my rare hero i got two rare heroes so i'm gonna just click on omni knight so all right you guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please uh, like, comment, subscribe, and let me know uh, if you enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be. There was a lot of cuts. Uh, it was a lot to go through, and especially because this, the system kept going down, which kind of sucked. But uh, I was happy that we got at least a couple of rares. Uh, I'm gonna wait for the market to go down. I'm gonna pick up the rest of the cards I need to start building decks with. So uh, see you guys later, and have yourselves a great day. Bye.